Okay, this is Costa Maya, Mexico. And as my husband pointed out, that uh, Sobo seems to have had a rough go of it here. <laughs> I don't know what that's about. Uh, oh, the lens keeps fogging up because of humidity. I can't, can't see the actual port. Yeah, at first I thought this was one of Carnival's biggies because I can see the water apart and stuff. And then I think they've put that on more and more ships. I see people having in the dining room on that ship. <laughs> All right, so I guess we're going to get dressed, have breakfast. And then I think we're going to spend the day in the port because they apparently have a pool and everything. So I'll take you along. These are the prettiest murals in Mexico. This one has water too. <laughs> okay, so we have another one. Here's our coconut. We'll go feel it and see what it says. <laughs> okay, what's the coconut feel like? The coconut feels dry and warm. <laughs> no coconut, run. <laughs> Half coconut. I like that hurricane class one. Okay, so we have to walk through another duty free shop to get anywhere, but this one is smaller. Okay, so the little area has the same Diamonds International. <laughs> oh, Mexican handicraft. It's pretty in here. A lot of the same stuff that you find it. Oh, the cruise ports. Hair braiding. <laughs> Oh, a Starbucks sign. I see a Starbucks sign. Oh, Wi-Fi over there. That'll be a popular spot. Stainless steel and rhodium and sterling silver jewelry. Oh, it's pretty in here. I'm going to stop just so I can take a little bit of a look around. Oh, this is one of those things where they do that flying act. It's quiet in here. Two ships are in, but our ship's at half capacity. All right, I'm going to turn this off and just kind of walk around. Oh, all the coconuts and hanging bananas. But I just found a Pandora store, so I'm going to check that out. Hey, let's go see what they have in here. I already have a Mexico charm, now. Okay, here's the pool at the port. There's lots of restaurants and shops. So I just got out of the pool and you see my feet are all sandy. And uh, yeah, this is my view right now. And there's restaurants and bars and then behind me are shops mostly. And then there's that aerial walk you can do around. It goes through an aviary part of it. So, anyway. I'm going to just rest up, drink my soda, and read my book a little while Jerry goes in the pool. Okay, so here's more of the little village. It's that bar. And more stores. Lots of them. I was just walking by one and man says, come in, this is your last chance to spend money. He's, uh, I guess, right, because it is our last uh, port. Ooh, now that's interesting. Look at all those leather shoes. Pretty. Oh, I haven't worn. Oh, I forgot my mask. I haven't worn those since the 70s. I have left them. <laughs> yep, they're real. <laughs> 
still as it can be. Okay, so I like this little store too, about a mask, <laughs> a Day of the Dead mask. We have lots of Day of the Dead stuff going on here. There's that walkway that continues off overhead. And then, I think this is a chocolate shop. Uh, it's a display, and then they sell it too. I think it has some history in here. Oh, uh, it definitely has air conditioning. Wow. This looks like it's a way out to the outside area. Let's take a peek. Uh, here's a list of all the stuff, I guess. Chocolate shop again. She had chocolate candles. I would buy one for a someone, but she's not eating chocolate, so. Oh yeah. There's a whole other area back here. Oh, that must be where you like swim with dolphins and stuff over there. Because I see people in a contained saltwater pool. So dolphins or turtles or something probably. And here's the back side of the pool. A uh, restaurant. And then those water fountains. I was under those for a while. And it keeps going around. Now that part of that above ground walkway, that part right there is an aviary. I can hear the birds. And then the wild birds are attracted to it. When I was over here in the pool, the wild birds kept coming to it. Okay, the case is all popped over the so you can buy chocolates. As well as all kinds of gift sets. There's lots of chocolate bars. And then they have this little display in history. I don't know if I'm supposed to be back here. This is like mangroves, yeah. What is it back here? Oh. A whole walking display. I'm the only one in here. Okay, grinding the cacao. There's little bird noises. Oh, and there's something where you can sit and watch. Probably someone gives some kind of talk or something here. More like cacao beans, and then like a modern kitchen, and more places where people can probably sit and watch a demonstration or a talk. Okay. If you've never seen where it comes from, it's that big bean, that, and the inside are those little, and then there's beans in there. So it's a little bit of work before it's the shop that we know. Okay, I found another mystery room, a dark room. <laughs> with a xylophone and trumpets. And I have no idea what this one's about. <laughs> Got a steampunk look to me. Look at the light fixture. No idea what this is about. <laughs> so let's just walk through it and see. All kinds of. What I think are electrical components. Uh, and here's, I guess, the scientific formula. Chocolate, maybe? <laughs> I kind of went the wrong way, didn't I? Should have started at the top. And then, there's an old typewriter, a chair, old cash register. I don't know how much you'll be able to see in this dark room. Old mixer. I don't know what this is. 
But this goes back around. I recognize this because it goes back around to that kitchen. So I turned around too soon. This is an old film projector thing. The reel to reel. One little light on. Flip the floor. Okay, according to sign, it's a dolphin experience, and I can actually see people over there with two dolphins with their heads above the water. Oh yeah, there they go moving. I don't know if you could see them. But I'm just looking for the rest. Oh, yeah, there they are, right? As the people are getting out, too. Oh, they jump back. Um, Do you want a cigar? No, thank you. Some more stores. I'm just looking for the bathroom, <laughs> which I can't seem to find. <laughs> About ready to give up on that and maybe go back to the ship for that. Okay, I didn't buy any cigars. I did buy a dress in there, two actually, and a magnet here. <laughs> oh boy, there's more. This place goes on forever. It's still promising to send me to a restroom I haven't found. Community center. Oh, those hats look inviting right now. Oh, there's the restrooms. Finally. <laughs> Oh, now I think I'm out of time. <laughs> See what's in here. Okay, across from the restrooms was this shop I've already been in. And another pharmacy. So I have lots of pharmacies everywhere. And the te tequila. Hello. Hi. Hola. How are you today? I'm good, thank you. How are you? Oh, in a purse store. I don't know, it looks like that, but it's about a Gucci. Gelato. Looks nice. I think this is a restaurant over here. But I think they take most of the food out to you at the beach in a bar. Nobody's sitting in there. Uh oh. I seem to run out of shopping center and I haven't found my husband. Have a pizza shop but it's not open right now and a lot of these were just like storefronts maybe I don't know exotic drinks yeah I think these are just storefronts right now businesses over there and they want me over there oh one of those fish spots no. I came out here to read, <laughs> but honestly, I find myself just wanting to close my eyes. Jerry's up in the Explorations Cafe area, which is a nice reading spot, but it's cold. And here, on this nice deck, it's nice and warm. Our second galanite, and these are our starters. And I think I'm probably going to have the crab Louis. And these are the entrees. Probably going to have the tenderloin with grilled shrimp and dessert. Oh, I forgot to read that. <laughs> I don't know what I'm having there. We'll see.